Hey, it's me. I'm a frog, but I'm in outer space. It's pretty cool. Everybody, I am Kindly Key and welcome back to the amazing frog. And this frog never ceases to amaze me. In the previous episode, we managed to make it to the moon and it was quite a process. But now that we've made it to outer space and the moon, we have a, what I assume is a lot of exploring to do. I mean, there's a giant frog statue on the moon. Who knew? And I'm sure there's other stuff too. Also, what are these things? This seems dangerous. I'm gonna jump into it. Because why not? I should have known. I should have known. I mean, it's a quick way to get out of that crater that we were in. But also, I saw rovers and, and I want to drive a rover. There was also jumps in there. I want to do some sick moon rover jumps. So let's fly <laughs> back down. Also, there's like a little tiny rocket. I don't know what that is. Wait, 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 wait. What is that on top of the building? Wait, is this, is this a... That's a cat! There's a cat hanging out on top of the, the space building. Okay, but I wanna know what this is. <gasps> it's a crossbow. I've got a crossbow. There you go. Shoot some croak cans. All right, but here's what I'm really here for. Let's go. It's not going. Why? Oh, I'm, I'm sitting on the wrong side. Frogs drive on the left side of the road. I got it all messed up. There you go. Okay, yeah. Oh, we're doing this. There is a jump directly in front of us and we are going to jump it and maybe do a backflip. Do a backflip. That, that wasn't a backflip at all, but that was still pretty cool. All right, I gotta say, driving a rover on the moon is, is pretty sweet. <laughs> oh my gosh. 360, 540, 720, 900. Take that, Tony Hawk. Okay, so now that I have this sweet moon rover, uh, we can actually get around the moon a, a lot quicker. So that's pretty sweet. Let's get out of the crater. Oh my gosh, I was not planning on launching out of the crater, but I mean, that's one way to do it. I do want to go over to this giant frog statue. And then also I see like what appears to be some kind of laser or something over there. You see that green thing way off in the distance. We need to go check that out. Giant frog statue. What? Why? Why are you here? What what does it all mean? Is there anything else here? It's like just a giant statue. But th there's there's nothing here? Wait, wait, what is that over there? That's a thing. Oh, it's one of those viewer thingies. Okay. Yeah, let's 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 see what we can see. Can I not use it? Yeah, there you go. Okay. I do see something over there. It's some kind of ring, maybe a teleporter. I see like Maybe like a red line or something. It's way out there. Oh, I can zoom in. Oh, we got some kind of wire running across the moon there. Okay. Also, that thing is straight out of Star Wars. If we go there, maybe we'll find Luke Skywalker. We found Darth Vader. Let's find out what's going on with this green laser. Kind of scared. Seems kind of dangerous, but I want to drive into it. And I, I can't really explain why. It might be mining. Is real bumpy terrain over here. It's kind of hard to drive on, not gonna lie. This seems like a terrible idea. I'm gonna get this thing blown up. And I'm and I'm gonna be happy about it. Y yep, yep. That that's what happens when you drive your moon rover into a space laser. It blows up. But now we know for sure, and, and now I'm kind of stranded. <laughs> There's a launcher thingy, Mabobber. And I do see the red wire over here. You know what? It might actually be like the, the border of, of the explorable area of the moon, maybe? Like you can't go past it. Oh, what are you? Oh my gosh, what is that? It's a space worm. Who put space worms on the moon? I was just running over here minding my own business and then suddenly there's some kind of Sarlacc monster. Get away from me. Okay. Okay. There are so Space worms on the moon. And I had no idea. Why didn't you warn me? So now I don't know if the space worm killed me or if it was the strange red moon fence that killed me. Now I need to know. What do you got? What do you got? A rover. That's not Luke Skywalker. That's just a remote controlled car. Okay, well, I'm officially disappointed. 
I kind of want to drive back to the area with the space worms. Although it's probably not a great idea. Wait, this is a big old crater. Is there anything in this big old crater? I just need to flip back over, please. Thank you. There appears to be nothing in this big old crater. It's kind of disappointing. Oh, hello. You're a space worm. Please leave me alone. Okay, I'm being chased by a space worm and I don't like it. I'm going this way. I'm going to the frog statue. Oh my gosh! That one was bigger than the other one. Oh, I don't like this. I don't, I don't like space worms. Okay, hear me out. Space laser plus space worm equals dead space worm. It blew up my rover. Why wouldn't it blow up a space worm? Okay, okay, this is my plan. It's not a good one. They're falling from the sky. Stop. Get away from me. This is a really hard area to drive my rover on. Okay, okay. He's getting a little bit closer. Doing, doing some flips. Cool. Good for you, space worm. Now, just don't drive yourself into the space laser. That's... That's probably a pretty good pro tip, right? Oh, I see, I, I see the dust. I saw you. How do we get these dudes to go into the laser? I need to get closer. I need to get closer. And they need to jump out right next to the laser. Okay, okay, don't go into the laser. Just go next to the laser. And then, and then, and then. Come on, jump in. Jump in, space worm! They're, they're not jumping into it. All that effort. And the space worms are immune to space lasers? Rude. Very rude. That space laser was supposed to vaporize those space worms and it did not and I'm mad. So instead of dealing with the space worms, I'm just gonna see what this red wire is. It's gotta be an invisible wall, right? Right? Oh yeah, uh, yeah, it is, it is. Okay, don't touch it. I touched it, I touched it. And that's what happens when you touch it. So my space rovers, they're gone and I'm sad. I feel like there's still more to see on the moon. Let's do some more exploring by launching our bodies at extremely high speeds and crashing him in, into the side of the planet, moon, whatever. What the heck is that? Is this Galaga? What is going on? Okay. Uh, I come in peace. Hello, 8-bit aliens. <laughs> what is happening? There's a pink glowy thingy over here. Let's grab it. Kind of crystal. Oh, gosh! Uh, am I dying? I'm, oh, I'm dying. Lesson learned. I found a new way to explore the moon at a very fast pace. Uh, just, just slide on your face. Wh who would have known? Frog travel is so efficient on the moon. It's incredible. Although it doesn't do great going up hills, but once you get over that hill, you're, you're jamming. Okay, so there is a bit of a legend here on the moon that I've been made aware of. I don't know exactly how it works, but those worms that were chasing us, oh, those were small fries. There's a real... Mama worm here on the moon and uh, there's there's some kind of way to spawn it. What happened the last time I touched this? Didn't it teleport me? No, it gave me a gun, a nerf gun. Take that giant space worm. So I am in the process of trying to find the legendary giant space worm because I want to see this thing and probably get eaten by it. I do feel like we were onto something with the tiny space worms and luring them into the laser? Cause like, why else would the laser be there? To protect you against space worms. So what if we took the legendary giant space worm and ran it into that giant green laser, vaporized it? I think that sounds pretty cool. But first things first, gotta find the giant space worm. I haven't been over to this area before. So, oh, there's a rover and a lunar lander. Okay, can I fly that thing? Please tell me I can fly that thing. Let's frog slide over to it. Oh, there's another item over here. Let's see what this is. Oh, we gotta drop this thing. Okay. Frog zapper? Yo, I got a laser! We got more Luke Skywalkers over here. These things have been nothing but disappointment. This one... Whoa. Whoa, okay. Please let me go. Let me go. 
let me go. Thank you very much. All right. Cool. Oh my gosh! Big Mama Space Worm, where the heck did you come from? Okay, um, yeah, I'm, I'm shooting it. I'm, no, no, I forgot how to shoot. It's a bad time to forget how to shoot. Okay, um, we gotta, we gotta get out of here. Um, get, get away, get away from me, get away from me. Please don't, er, er, I, I've lost words. I was gonna say, please don't eat me, and I just said, please don't ear. That was a surprise. I gotta say, uh, that worm came out of nowhere. Where did it go? Did it leave? No, it did not leave. It's underneath me. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, you're so big and scary and gross. We're gonna take this thing to the laser. You're, you're coming with me to the giant laser cannon. That's what's happening. Oh, I really hope this works. Where is it? Oh, gosh. It's disgusting. This thing is truly disgusting. Ah, get away! Stop trying to eat me. You think it can eat the the whole thing? Like me and the the rover? Get away! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Please let me out. Let me out! I don't want to be here with this giant space worm. No! Let me go. Oh my gosh! I escaped. Get, get, Get in the rover, you dumb frog! Please, just, just get in. Just, just get in. You, you just, it's, is it really, is it really that hard to just get in the rover? Come on, man! Please, 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 I'm gonna get eaten. I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm, I, why? Why do you have to do this to me? All I had to do was get in the rover. Was it so much to ask? Okay, so I think I came from up there. So I probably died somewhere over here. Oh yeah, yeah. I see the giant space worm. I see the dust. I don't see it, but I see the dust. Yeah, there it goes. <laughs> oh my gosh, I hate it so much. Okay, okay. We just need to get in to the rover and then drive towards the laser. It's easy. It's so easy. Okay, yeah, neat trick. Cool, yeah, show off. Oh! Why? Okay, okay, we have a very, very important decision to make here. Do we get out of the rover and lure the space worm that way? Or, oh, I don't think it's working. I feel like he went through it. Maybe I just, maybe I just didn't do it good enough. Okay, you know what? I'm, I'm getting out. This is a huge risk. But I'm a little bit more maneuverable. Don't do it. Don't. Just, just stand between the worm and the laser. It's science. No, it's not science. This is, this is very unsciencey. Come on, get me. I dare you. Oh, look at that. I farted in the worm's face. Chase me, you fool. Here we go. We got it lined up. He's over there. He's coming for me. He's got to jump out, though. He's got to jump out into the laser. This is the issue. He's not... He's not jumping into the laser. What are you doing? What are you doing, Space Worm? Doing flips and stuff? Now you're just showing off. Oh, no. Get me out. Get me out. We're... Okay, we're flying into space. That's... That's pretty cool. I somehow survived that. Space Worm. What are you doing? Okay, he's sinking back into the ground. He's coming back for more. He loves the frog meat. Tastes like chicken. At least that's what I've heard. I've never actually eaten frog before. Please just jump into the laser. If I could get him to like attack me, he, he seems to like when he latches onto me, he really jumps out of the, oh, what? Am I dead? No. The space worm is dead. The giant moon worm got fried by the giant laser. Sweet, this outfit is in his stomach? I killed the giant moon worm? I did it! That's right, moon worm. You got nothing on this frog. Holy cow, my heart is racing. I had no idea what, what happened there. I think he like grabbed me and, and just kind of fell into the laser and blew up. 
I mean, he literally got vaporized. We just became Boba Fett. That's incredible. That is so awesome that that actually worked. I'm unbelievably happy. I want to go back to the base and become Boba Fett. And then is there a costume changey thingy-mabobber in here somewhere? Maybe we can teleport. Okay, let's teleport. Whoop. Yes. Can I change here? Yes. Special outfits. <gasps> Bounty frog. <laughs> what? Are you serious? That is so cool. I I'm I'm Boba Fett frog. Incredible. Whoa, what? He's got a jetpack. That doesn't even seem fair, but that's incredible. Holy cow. Okay. This this is awesome. I have become the bounty hunter frog I always knew I could be. So is Big Mama Worm like gone forever? That kind of bums me out. You see how fast I can move on the moon now? This is so cool. I'm just gonna quickly grab my laser rifle. Seems appropriate. Oh, it's just a crossbow? That's a little disappointing. I think she's gone for good, which kind of makes sense because I, I did kind of vaporize her in a giant space laser. But on the bright side, I mean, look at this suit. I have a jet pack. I have a crossbow. I am Boba Fett the frog. And it is, it is truly incredible. Space did not let me down. Let's just say that. But that was quite the adventure for this episode. I think that's going to do it for this one. If you guys enjoyed it, be sure to hit that like button. And if you have suggestions for other things that we can do in Amazing Frog, let me know in the comment section down below. I still feel like there's more to see, more to do, more weirdness to be had. But that is going to do it for this episode. Thank you for watching. See you guys next time.